Welcome to the channel, human. Halloween, one of the best horror movies ever made, and your boy is going to talk about it. Michael Myers is a disturbed child. One day he decides to kill his sister. He's like, I'm tired of that bitch, and he stabbed her up, and that landed him in a mental institution. You fast forward some years later, Lori Strode is walking around doing her thing in life. And she is also connected to Michael Myers. That's his other sister. And Michael decides to stay in a mental institution for some years. And one day, he just decides to break out. He's like, it's time for me to kill my other sister. Lori has been out there walking around thinking everything's okay. She's not expecting this knife to go through her fucking neck. So Michael breaks out of the institution, steals somebody's car, and he just knows how to drive. Nobody didn't, nobody taught him nothing about nothing. He just already knew how to drive the car. Sure enough, he puts on the iconic mask that you see in this film. On a scale from 1 to 10, 1 being horseshit on a hot, smelly-ass day, and 10 being mind-blowingly amazing, I'm going to give this movie a 10 out of 10. This is a perfect horror movie. Everything that happens in this movie with the acting, the camera angles done by the brilliant John Carpenter, the way the music is utilized for every single scene and moment to increase intensity. And you know that Michael Myers is just casually stalking Laurie Strode and other humans. Like He just be waiting and shit like Michael is a patient killer. That's what makes him so great. He ain't got a rush. That's why he was chilling in a mental institution. He could have broke out any time, killed everybody in that building, but he had to wait. He wanted to wait. To me in life, if you got patience, you can accomplish anything. Michael Myers was like, look, family. You look, I ain't no Dominic Toretto. You my sister, and I'm about to stab your shit up. This is the first movie, and you gots to die. And I felt that as a kid. I was like, this movie is awesome. I was actually cheering for Michael Myers. I wanted him to kill Laurie Strode, but then Laurie Strode ended up being a good character, so I was kind of on her side, and then she actually did kind of fight him off and stuff, and then Dr. Loomis shot him multiple times, and then Michael Myers was like, R really? And it, it, he just, just got up and shit, and it was like, how the fuck you just shake off bullets like that, like you got punched or something? Like, Dr. Loomis is another great character in this movie. I feel like, he just be trying to let humans know what's up. And they don't get it. They don't get it. But Dr. Loomis understands. There ain't nothing but, but blackness in the eyes, right? Remember that speech that he gives? It was it's just one of the most iconic speeches in horror movies. Like, Dr. Loomis was trying to tell these fucking humans. They're like, nah, nah, he just a man. You don't know what you're talking about. Like, look, motherfucker, you weren't looking deep into his eyes and saw absolutely nothing. He about to kill you and your entire family because you don't fucking listen. So, yeah, Michael Myers is the shit. If you like horror movies and you haven't seen the original Halloween, you fucking up with your life. You better check this movie out ASAP. And if you have seen it, watch it again. Terrence out.